All right, situation is generator doesn't want to stay running underneath of a load. This is upside down in the carburetor, but this is the drain for the carburetor bowl. So when it quit, I opened that up and nothing came out. So that told me there was a clog, something in the bottom of the carburetor. And this piece here is your fuel shutoff solenoid. And right here where all these wire holes are, these were pretty much plugged up. It was all tarnished with some gunk down there. So I'm cleaning this off. That way the fuel can flow through properly. Because what this fuel shutoff solenoid does is it shuts the fuel off and we turn off the generator. So if this can't open up fully and then all your fuel can't go through, so the generator will not run properly. So clean this up when you're doing your service on your generators. A lot of people will take this piece out of the bottom, think it's nothing, spray it off and call it good. But if you don't take this apart, make sure things work. Make sure this plunger in here goes in and out properly. You're missing one of the important steps because all the stuff that is bad in carburetors settles to the bottom, which is this part.